Greg Lauderd here, host of Off the Diamond segment for ESPN Chattanooga. We're on our way to Hickson High School to talk to a couple of baseball players. Jake, give me the keys. Let's go. Greg Lawrence here, hanging out at Hickson High School with my man Cooper Collins. He's third baseman, also does some pitching, mostly a pitcher, but mm -hmm. sometimes third base as well. We're going to hang out at third base. We're going to take some ground balls with him. We're going to get a chance to know him a little bit. Let's do it. You ready? Yes, sir. All right, man. So what do you like most about playing third base? I know you're mostly a pitcher, but what is the action that mm -hmm. goes on? like? Send a runner come, come to third and get him out. That's usually a good feeling. We're seeing one of our outfielders get a good throw down and tagging the runner out. That's, that's always a good feeling. Now, the, the third base is called the hot corner for a reason. Obviously, you're close to the batter here. Usually, a right handed batter is just going to turn on a ball. Are you somebody that is just likes to sort of quick react, or do you like the ball sort of side to side and make a play left to right? Usually, to me. I like making the play to me. It's always simpler because I don't have the best of range, being honest with you. So <laughs> He's a pitcher though, he's an athlete. Yeah, so if it just comes to me, it's usually better like that. But okay. also making a play backhand. Backhands, I love making backhand plays because it's, it gets the crowd going and everything. Mm -hmm. so. Now I noticed you have a 44 glove. Why 44 glove? I have a first baseman glove mm -hmm. at 44. Is there a certain reason why you like the 44 glove? Um, for me, it's usually cheaper for me. So that's why I liked it and having it customized to my liking. It's always good to have. Yeah, cheaper is, is usually the better option. Mm -hmm. The 44 gloves are great quality. Yeah. You can you can get your name right on them. You got the big 44 on the on the back side. Mm -hmm. uh, it's, it's pretty cool. All right, let's hit a couple more ground balls. Okay, boy. Oh my goodness. We're hitting hot shots. Hot so when it comes to, to, to the third baseman right there um, and, and getting a hot shot, like you mentioned, um, taking it and really just keeping it in front of you, I think is probably the bigger deal because, you know, again, you're real close to the batter, usually hitting the ball hard, just kind of like that one and just keeping it in front of you. Talk about how important that is just playing third base. You know, just keeping it in front. If there's a runner on second, let it, if you let it go by, it's probably allow a run. But if you keep it in front, it's usually, guarantee running around pretty yeah, much. Yeah, you're going to have a good opportunity to get that guy because all you're taking off the chest, pick it up with the bare hand, flip it across. Uh, no, one thing that I noticed that you do really well is you feel that ball way out in front. You don't ever really kind of let it get back into your body. Why, why is that? Um, usually just because if you let it go in more between the legs, more ch greater chance of the ball going between your legs. But keeping it out front, usually if it bounces, more better chance of getting out. All right, so tell us a little bit about uh, Coach Green. What's it like playing for Coach Green? Well, playing for Coach Green is an amazing thing, I think. Probably one of the better coaches I've ever had. Um, wants us to work hard in the classroom and also wants us to work hard on the field, in it in and off the field. Um, wants what's best for us, too, off the field. Um, you know, if, like, I'm trying to think of a word. So, like a second father, mm -hmm. pretty much. He just wants you to be the best person you can be and really wants what's best for you. So you're a senior this year at Hickson. What's been your experience like getting a chance to play baseball here for as long as you have and you know this being your last season? It's it's been an honor having him as a coach and it's just been an honor being part of this program. I mean last year winning district with the team, with the boys. It was really fun I thought. Um, going on to substate, that was really fun too. Um, sadly losing the substate game, not going to state, but um, last year was fun. I think it's been fun all four years. It's been a pleasure being here. Now, you also said that you're a pitcher as well. What is sort of, what, what did you gravitate, gravitate towards the mound? What, what do you like most about getting on with the bump, getting up on the bump and, and, and pitching? I think having the eyes, it, it's like your world and it's just, it's just you. You control the game, you control the pace of the game. That's what I like about the most. Or in a tight situation, you need to get like, one more out or whatever, or one more strike and you're out of the inning, it's a tight inning. That's usually a good feeling. Like I said before, hearing the crowd, the war and everything is a real good feeling to have. All right, let's do our quick triple play at the end. I'm gonna ask you three quick questions. First thing that comes to your mind, you ready? All right. Okay, first one, 
What is your favorite ballpark food? Um, hot dog. Hot dog, okay. Best first date spot to take a girl <laughs> in terms of a sporting event. Is it a basketball game, baseball game, or a football game? Definitely a lookouts game, but if it goes good, then a Braves game for sure. <laughs> All right, so we're going lookouts first, and if it goes good enough, okay, now we can take her up to the majors. We start her in yeah. the minors, then we take her up Pretty to the much. majors. All right, and last thing, are you a single stuffed or a double stuffed Oreo kind of guy? Got to go double stuffed. Double stuffed. It's a lot man. better. All right, Kay Cooper uh, Collins, our guest <laughs> here on uh, our Off the Diamond segment with Hicks and Baseball. Appreciate you, man. Thank you so much.